Hi guys, I'm your host from Hairsite.com, bringing you hair restoration news from around the world for over 20 years. Today's video is produced in collaboration with Hassan and Wong, a top three hair clinic in the world according to our patient result statistics. Good news in the quest for a new tropical treatment for hair loss. If you recall, news about the possibility of a Korean hair loss cure broke out in the forum on Hairsite.com a couple of years ago. The research was led by Dr. Choi and his team from Yonsei University in South Korea. The study was published in the Journal of Investigative Dermatology, U.S. National Library of Medicine, and covered by news media such as Korea Times and South China Morning Post. Well, folks, we have new developments since the news last broke out on Hairsite.com. We can now confirm that CK Biotechnology Inc. in South Korea has planned human trials and commercial development for a topical hair loss treatment based on the research findings at Yonsei University. Not surprisingly, as you can see from their website, the CEO of CK Biotechnology, Dr. Kang Yel Choi, is also the very scientist who led the team in the research. This new treatment is based on the premise that WNT signaling pathways inside of a cell are responsible for follicle development and hair regeneration in humans. Here we have an example of WNT signaling in cell development. These pathways are usually made of proteins and they communicate important cell activity and signals to various cells throughout our body. As previously reported in another video on our YouTube channel and also on Hairsite.com, it was discovered that a certain protein named CXXC5 disrupts the cellular activity of WNT signaling pathways and can cause hair loss as a result. In an attempt to counter the undesirable activity of CXXC5 on hair growth, Choi and his team discovered a new biochemical substance that can act as CXXC5 inhibitor and promote hair growth. The new compound is called PTD-DBM. PTD is short for Protein Transduction Domain, while DBM is short for Disheveled Binding Motif. That is a mouthful, I must say. I wish they would come up with something easier to read. For the nerds among us, you can read more about this in the Journal of Investigative Dermatology. The title is Targeting of CXXC5 by a Competing Peptide Stimulates Hair Regrowth and Wound-Induced Hair Neogenesis. And of course, the million-dollar question, when will this treatment be available? Here's CK Biotechnology's timeline for topical PTD DBM on their website. As you can see, they're currently in preclinical trial right now. The plan is to start phase one trial in 2021, phase two in year 2023, and phase three in year 2025. So we're potentially looking at five years when the product hits the market, assuming all goes well with the trials. To learn more about this topic or other advanced hair restoration techniques, contact Hassan and Wong for a free consultation. No cost, no fee, just good, honest information. Hassan and Wong is a sponsoring clinic of Hairsight with over 15 years of uninterrupted patient records and presently a top three hair clinic in the world according to our patient results statistics.